What's going on ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy the Bearded Trainer coming at you with another episode of Pokemon Go. How's everybody doing today? Today is Raid Day and we have two Tier 5 Legendaries that are going to be giving you a big boost in PvP, Great League and Ultra League alike. We've got Cresselia and Registeel appearing in Raids. Let's go, that's what's up. <sighs> now as you can see, I've got construction equipment around me. Well, let's see, maybe right here. There we go. I'm currently at work and I wanted to get this intro done for you guys just because I was thinking about you. Anyway, so we've got two legendaries in there that are going to be great for PvP. we got Cressilia and Registeel appearing tonight from 6 to 7 in your local time. Let me know down in the comments below who you looking to catch. Are you trying to get that shiny Cressilia or are you trying to bag yourself that Registeel? Uh, before I continue, please make sure that you subscribe to the channel if you're new. Make sure that you uh, hit that like button if you are enjoying the content. And up here, there's a little notification bell that you can hit to get updated whenever I bring new content to you. Uh, I'm hoping that I get out of work in time so I can run the raid hour tonight because I'd really like to bag both of those shinies. Um, my wife and I on the Colossal Discovery Day, we did happen to get the Reggie Ice uh, at the same time, both shiny, uh, during that event. So that was a really uh, special moment. It was a sweet moment. Um, that being said, uh, we also have some Team Rocket uh, research that we need to finish. We got to defeat the executives and the boss in order to get ourselves the Shadow Entei. So I'm going to finish up this work day um, and we'll see what happens. I'll see you out there. Ladies and gentlemen, we are on our way to the first raid location. I happen to make it back to my side of town in time. So, oh, what you're gonna see now is an absolutely gross, disgusting mess of a bearded trainer from a long day. Go get us some shinies. So, we will see you when we get to the first raid. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back. We are at the first raid, a Cresselia raid. Uh, as you can see, the recommended gave me T-Tar, uh, two T-Tars, three Dark Rise, and a Rock Wrecker right here. Right here. So, let's see if we can go ahead and get this first Cresselia. See if we can get one and done. That'd be great. What part of this event are you looking for? Are you looking for Reggie Steel? Are you looking for? Oh, I love it. Uh, are you looking for? Uh, Cresselia, I'm looking for the shinies personally. So we just jumped in. I've got a call coming in. I've got to dodge that call and do this raid. So here we go. First one to go. Let's see how many we can get. We got into the raid a little bit late. We were playing uh, hide and seek with uh, the rest of the raid group, unfortunately. Um, but we made it. So if we can get one, they're already starting to bolt trying to shoot and drive is not going to be the most productive thing for me. It's not safe, so I don't recommend it. Oh. Alright, so one's out the door. Alright, we've got four people in this lobby with 248 seconds left on the clock. I'm sure we can do it. Alright. Bike Crunch T-Tars are going hard, but not hard enough. Alright, looks like the Cresselia is going down. And we're off. Got that one down. All right, here we go. I apologize if I'm not looking at the screen. The road is much more important. So I do not know what the final CP was, but this will be our Dex entry, Cresselia. All right, what do we got here? Finally, we got the shiny check. Cresselia went down. We don't know what the final CP is, but we know it's 1633. Is it shiny? Um, I don't know. Doesn't look like it. 1577, this probably isn't gonna be a good one. We're gonna go ahead and catch this, probably head off to the next raid and we'll be back. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are about 100 seconds away from the next Cresselia raid. We got here just in time. There's all kinds of crazy going on. We've got we've got two groups running in the Pasco County Raiders. We have the catch group and then we have the um, the experience group. Now, again, I'm trying to get that shiny if I can, so I'm gonna take my time uh, or potentially to 100%. So that's the goal. That's always the goal. We want to get those hundos. We want to get those uh, those uh, those shinies, especially when they're deck entry shinies. So if I can nail that today, that would be amazing. If not, it's okay. We tried. 
So when this raid kicks off, we will be right back. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have officially jumped into the next of the Cresselia raids. I may be getting some phone calls here, so please bear with me, uh, but we're gonna go ahead and skip them until we get the raid done. We've got 14 people in. Uh, remember, 1633 is that 100%. Let's hope we get it. And this one will go down a heck of a lot faster than the last one. So, I had to make sure my mic was on. I have an issue sometimes where I forget to turn on my mic. But yes, we're already more than uh, a quarter of the way down uh, since we have 14 versus four. Now, told you. So, there we go. This is taking longer than I want. Oh my gosh. <laughs> All right, trying not to accidentally close out the game. I'm already dealing with a lot of lag. We've got the first part of the group running now, and this one is almost down. So, let's see if we get that shiny, that hundo, that shundo, or at least a decent IV one. All right, come on, drop that rock, that rock wrecker on him. We go and this one goes down we are looking at a top cp of come on 100 percent 1586 not great but is it going to be shiny let's find out here we go with the shiny check in uh three two one is it shiny no it's not shiny all right we're going to catch this we're going to catch up with the raid group and we will be back all right, ladies and gentlemen, we have we took down that Cresselia. It was a 1586, not very good whatsoever, but we're about to jump into a Reggie Steel raid right now. Uh, we are with the fast group. We've got about five seconds left before we go in. Uh, we got Charizard, Garchomp, Machamp, uh, Heatran, and two Heracrosses, which is what the recommended uh, set gave me. So we're going to try to take this down, hopefully get the shiny of it, because that is one thing I did not get during the Colossal Discovery event, uh, was the shiny. It is 6.50, so we got 10 minutes left in the raid hour. Maybe, maybe, we will be able to get uh, one more Cresselia raid, and I'm really hoping that's the case. Uh, so let's take this thing down as quickly as we can, and uh, hope that it's blue. Uh, whether I get the shiny of this, I'm not really uh, concerned about. Like I said, it's not particularly... Uh, the Reggie's got cool lore, but they're not really my, my cup of tea. Reggie Steel goes down. What are we looking at? We are looking at... 1358. So, not very good, but is it shiny? Can it be shiny? Will it be shiny? Let's check. Three, two, one. Did we get the blue? Oh, no, we didn't. Okay, that's cool. So at 1358, again, not very good. We're going to go ahead and catch this, and we're going to jump to the next rate. We'll be back. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, so I'm a little sad right now. My battery died in the middle of the last raid, and then in the middle of the catch. So I ran from that in order to try to get to this next raid. It looks like we made it to the next raid, but there is no raid. Raid hour is officially concluded. I don't know if they're going to be doing a few more after this. I'm a little sad, but we did get two Cresselia. We got two Cresselia. It would have been three, but I legitimately ran. 1586. This isn't going to be a great one either. Uh, no. So, and the last one, 1577. We did not get a good Cresselia, and even more saddening, we did not get the shiny. So, um, hopefully, we'll hit a couple more raids after this, and uh, if we do, we'll be back. If we don't, then we got to start the end of the Team Rocket research, which could always prove to be more fruitful than the actual raid hour was. We'll see you then. All right, my trainer nation, like I said, I'm a little bit disappointed about how raid hour went. I was only able to get in three raids, four, I didn't catch the Reggie Steel, I didn't catch one of the Cresselia, I was trying to get to the next raid, and I, it has just dawned on me that from now on, I'm not going to do raid hours uh, like that unless I'm absolutely able to, so, um, yeah, it could have been a little bit more interesting if... I was able to take the time to, so I do apologize to all of you who have taken the time to watch this. However, as I said before, we do have Team Rocket research that we need to finish, and I have found a cliff. So we are going to knock out Mr. Cliff, and I'm going to try to position you a little bit more adequately. There you go. And we're going to knock out this cliff. So, what does he have right now? He has pincer. Alright, so... 
I'm not really sure what his lineup is going to be. To be honest with you, I haven't done these in a while. We're going to knock out one of the radars. Hopefully, we're going to get a shiny. Apparently, it's telling me to use an Arcanine, so we're going to go with the Arcanine. All right, here we go. First run. Let's see if we can knock this out. I'm sure he's got a pincer. And then everything else after that is a complete guess to me. Now, the same goal of always, I've got a fire type right here that's able to... Uh, deal damage. Wow, he is spanking me. I'm going to have to use a shield now. Uh, but we have a fire type here that we're going to try to prompt a shield. Um, you know what? I should have probably just started this with uh, my Lucaria. Look at that. Okay, we're going to switch and we're going to try to get a power up punch here right off rip. Uh, this isn't going to go so well. Alright, there we go. So we're going to knock out the first shield uh, and hopefully we'll be able to get another one off. I'm not going to bother doing the exercise because he's going to block it. All right, so let's see if we can make a comeback because it's not looking fantastic right here. He's going to probably get another attack off. There we go. I am going to use my shield. All right, come on. What you got, dude? Uh, X scissors. Now, I don't. I think I could have actually tanked that, but we're going to go ahead and burn this last shield. And hopefully everything else will go a little bit easier from here on out. Let's see if we can make the comeback. Here we go. All right, now, come on. Come on. Tap them out, tap them out, tap them out, tap them out. Okay, good. We actually still have all three Pokemon. Not like Arcanine's really going to be able to do a whole lot right here. Um, okay, so that's cool. All right, we got this one. Now, that Almastar is doing a lot of damage off rip, so we're going to try to get this uh, bit of damage done. Hope it's not going to take him out per se, but it is definitely going. We got a second one ready to go. It is doing type effectiveness uh, damage to him. All right, it's a water and rock type. We've got a fighting type. Oh, we might actually be able to. We tapped it out. What? Are you serious? And we got enough for another power-up punch, and it's T-Tar. Oh, what? What? Lucario is my dude MVP. Oh, my goodness. Are we going to get it? We got it with just Lucario. Are you serious right now? Oh my goodness, that is amazing. All right, so we have officially defeated Cliff. Are we gonna get his uh, purple pincer? Let's see here. So let's do our uh, shiny check. Three, two, one, purple, 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 purple. No, I didn't get it. We got one out of the way. Unfortunately, it wasn't shiny, and that really bums me out. Um, is it any good? question of the day not at all but that's okay so we've got one of these knocked out all right now we need to go find a Sierra and an Arlo so I think there is one actually right over here let me double check okay we have another okay right over here by the park we've got a few of them okay that works out great I think I know where these two are up here on the top we will be back Ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, we have tracked down Sierra. Uh, I do not know what she's going to have as a whole. If she has a Lapras, I'm in good shape. Uh, if she has a Houndoom, I'm in good shape. As far as the rest of her lineup, I'm not 100% sure. I know that Beldum is going to start. We are going to take her out and hopefully get a shiny Beldum. So let's see what happens here. I'm going to move you guys back into that better location. There we go. All right. So let's get this going. We have... We need to heal up Lucario, like, for reals. All right, so let's heal him up real quick, and then, um, oh, it looks like a lot of my dudes have taken some damage. All right, let's do some fast hyper potion -y. All right, there we go. They're good to go. All right, let's take on Sierra. All right, this shouldn't be too bad. Uh, come on. Um, I think I'm going to switch immediately to Lucario, just so I can get the... Um, well, it's not going to let me. Okay, so I am um, turn locked. But I do know that we are going to burn the first shield. So that's a great thing. And that's one shield down. All right, what you got? What you got? What you got? Can we get another one off? Can we keep... Bel See, I really like keeping Beldum alive just long enough so I can get the two off. That's why I like using Lucario. It's quick. It's not... Oh, okay. Um... We've got a Sharpedo. I didn't expect Sharpedo. Can we take out Sharpedo? Can we punch it? Can we punch it? It doesn't like being punched. Oh, man. Oh, man. Machamp's 
doing work. All right, I think we got this. We're gonna go with my dude, the one and only Lucario. Now, here's hoping for Houndoom. There it is. And we are going to hit it with a Shadow Ball. Uh, it should be over after this. Kamehameha! Oh, I forgot. Ghost type is not effective against Dark type. But we still punched him out. That was really fast. I remember when these guys were such a struggle. And uh, there we go. We've defeated Team Rocket Leader Sierra. And can we get a shiny Beldum? A shadow, or a shiny Beldum. A, yeah, can we get shiny Shadow Beldum? All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Is it? No, I want one. And we got the Beldum. Uh, so uh, I'm gonna go find us an Arlo, because that's all we need next, and we will be back. All right, ladies and gentlemen, and just like that, we find an Arlo right across the street from the Sierra. That's uh, pretty convenient. So we got Mawile, and again, it's gonna be, uh, your guess is as good as mine, but maybe we can get that shiny shadow Mawile. That would be amazing. Um, so let's go into this. I think I'm gonna need to heal up a couple of guys for sure, my champ. I don't know why my uh, my Arcanine keeps showing up in the mix, um, but we apparently this is the team that I used with him last, so we'll see how this works. Uh, I like Arcanine. It was probably one of the first Pokemon that I really enjoyed um, in the anime. So, real quick. Who's your favorite Pokemon growing up? Are you a Gen 1-er like I am? Like I go, wow. Okay, Arcanine's putting that, putting them, put them hands on there. Right, I'm, not, I'm gonna, I'm gonna see if I can tank whatever it hits. Uh, ooh. Oh. Uh, but yeah, like I was saying, who was your favorite Pokemon growing up, man? I grew up as a Gen 1 dude. You know, Charizard, Arcanine. I had a love of fi fire types. Oh man, this ain't good. We got a flying. Um, Flying fire type, and I'm a steel fighting type, so we really are at every possible disadvantage right now. Can we? Mm, no, no. Come on. Can we pull this off? We might get tanked here. All right, at least. Come on. It's gonna be a second shield, isn't it? Yep, I knew it. Oh man, we're gonna have to go back into this. I'm literally getting spanked. That was literally half a whack. All right, who do I got left? I have Machamp, okay. Well, that's a little bit better. I don't know if it's gonna really help me out here. It's not giving me the double, the four times, uh, four times weakness that I had before. So we know these got Charizard, we know she's got Char, or Heart, he's got Charizard. Okay, not very effective, not very good. Can we pull this off? All right, I am going to use a shield now. Uh, can we pull this off? That overheat would have been nasty, but we can tap him. All right, now we just need to hope that he has something weak against fighting as his final Pokemon. Can we get this? Oh, it's a Salamance. This is not going to be good. We've got a lot of hurt coming. Oh, come on. Not very effective at all. We got another one. Can we pull this off? I don't think we're gonna pull this off, but if we can clutch this, that would be the dopest thing ever. Come on, that's not good. Nope. We are not gonna make it. He's gonna whack me once. Yep. Ah. Uh, all right. So we know that he's got Mawile, um, Mawile, Charizard, and that thing that hurts so much. All right, I got you, Blanche. So we're gonna take another shot at it. I guess we're gonna go in one more time. This is like a series of fail. So let's. Uh, Let's try not to fail this time. I feel like Garchomp was a bad, or uh, Gyarados was a bad choice. I don't ever remember having this much difficulty in dealing with Arlo. All right, there's one shield down. We got this. We can take this. I really thought Titar would be able to do a lot more damage overall to um, the Charizard, but Charizard just was a tank. Um, can I handle it? Will we take it? I don't know. Okay. That's cool with me. Oh, come on. We can do this. Come on. 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 Come on.
come on. Uh, there we go. Now punch that thing out. Punch it 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 out. All right. Now let's get a few shots on Charizard before he just tanks me. All right, cool. We go. Power up punch ready to go. All right, there we go. I can't believe that Salamance took me the way it did. I'm so close to throwing my phone, it's not even funny. Come on. All right, we know he's going down. All right, my dude. Come on, let's... Uh, wash him out okay there we go fire spin should not do much um, can we just tap him out no I, I'm going to shield on this one that way I can save the hydro pump for my wonderful little salamance up here in the next round okay come on because I know he is gonna shred my uh, my Gyarados so let's get this off one big big attack at a time that way when I get my outrage going I got a shield and then that will take him out yeah so I have more than enough to get him with the outrage I might even get him with one more <laughs> oh, they have a tendency to just slap you right in the face when it comes to getting off that charge move all right Salamance is hitting hard from the get-go but it looks like we got it this time that's what's up all right my dude Garchomp for the win. Shut this thing down. There we go. Bam! What? I better get a shiny off of this. Or, or what? What am I going to do? Shiny check. Seven balls. Three, two, one. Show me a Shadow Mall one. Is it? It's not. We have one last challenge that we need to overcome in order to complete the research and that is defeat Giovanni. We didn't find the boss but that's okay. We will uh, find him come community day. Uh, we got a couple of things happening on community day. We have uh, an EX raid happening on community day and uh, of course we have Abra, uh, Abra. We're gonna hunt down the boss and we're gonna finish up the team rocket research. So if you guys enjoyed the video please remember to hit that like button. If you're new to the channel please subscribe. I do have several forms of social media, which you'll be seeing links in the description, as I will have them in the bottom of the screen. Uh, please check me out. I'm on Instagram at the Beard uh, the Bearded Go Trainer. I am on Facebook. Uh, I have two groups uh, available right now for you to come and hang out and, and get involved in the community. Uh, one of them is the Trainer Nation, Bearded Trainers Trainer Nation, and then come like the page for the Bearded Trainer. I'd love to have you out there uh, and uh, get to know some of you guys. Um, the other thing is I have a Twitter. You can find me at the Bearded Trainer Zero. Uh, so please go ahead, hit me up, give me a follow, come say what's up, and I hope to see you guys out there at Al Lopez Park. Peace!